Hey guys, it's Halloween Hotman. Today's video, we're going to do an unboxing of Spirit Halloween's 2023 stilts. Alright, guys, got this giant thing in my room. A little bit of a questionable video that I'm filming in here, but we're going to try it. This thing is seven, it's like eight feet. My ceilings are eight feet, so I might not have, might have to take one pull out of his legs for able to do a demo of him, but I will do a full setup in here. So let's try this. Alright. This is the tallest box I have ever seen from a spirit prop. This thing is huge. We're gonna actually gonna lay this down. Get my reaction of me opening it. Righty. Looks like it's a slide out thing. We're gonna slide the whole thing out of the ground here. Whoa. Look at the size of that head, it's huge. I raised the camera back up. It's not really a slide out thing. Got one of his leg pulls here. I actually got one of his giant feet here. All right, a whole bunch of stuff in here. Another big shoe, another leg pull. And then we got his giant base with some pulls and stuff zip tied to that. Got his instructions. And last thing in there is his after. All right, let's get everything sorted out because there's a lot of stuff going on. This is crazy. Let's start setting them up. Okay, this first thing starts. This head is giant. Holy crap. Jeez. Mine came not deformed whatsoever. Wow. Little thing in the chin there, it's easy to fix. Jeez. That's incredible. This head is giant. Okay, guys, just look at everything here. There's a lot of parts. We've got his base in the middle there. Start putting them together. All right, first things first, you want to get the base pointing in the direction you want. Get the shoes, doesn't matter which side they go on. One thing is, they don't have like the foot sliding thing. That's something. Like even the old stuff now, that makes sure the foot doesn't slide around, but whatever. Got these two poles, not labeled, just regular poles. And we're gonna put it in like that. Our next step, we're gonna put the upper leg poles on. Again, does not matter. All right, got all, every single leg piece on. Now we're going to throw on the pants. All right, got all his legs on, and now we're going to put on the mechanism. All right, got both of his legs on, mechanism on. Getting way up there. I got to point the camera up even more. All right, he's getting way up there. I'm going to put on his hip loop now. Yeah, tricky to weave it through everything you could. Also put this on underneath, like the mech, when you put the mechanism on. Got that on. We're gonna grab this big arch humpback right here. Put this on. All right, he got his back humpback on. If yours comes so it's really hard to put on, you can slightly bend the metal on the back to get that on. And we're gonna bring his full on legs fully up here. Alrighty, this thing is getting huge. Look at all the way up there. It's almost not in frame. It's this guy is so big. Alrighty, next step. This should be fun. I'm gonna put on this top here. Oh, uh, it is not full Velcro, unfortunately. So you can uh, have fun putting it over this thing. Alright, got his shirt on, and that was really tricky. It's super tight to get on there. But now let's cut to the time lapse and me putting on his arms. Well guys, still fits. But without his two poles. <laughs> yeah, here he is. He's all set up with not in his not his full eight foot tall i took these poles out so we can fit in my room let's plug them in and do a demo all right just turn them in the sensor mode let's go in front of them
Very cool. All right, guys, that was still the clown. <laughs> Looks like he's going again. Very cool, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and we'll see you in the next one. Peace.